Hello everyone, and I welcome all of you to online study for you a complete placement solution. Friends, this is Pratik Srivastava here, and today in this video, I am going to tell you what actually is going to happen with Infosys 2020 batch. That means the interview will be scheduled for 2020 batch or not. Okay, so friends, all the information about 2020 batch you will be getting in this video. So please watch the video till the end and. I will be also discussing about the computer networks LAN, MAN, WAN and OSI model that is frequently getting asked in the Infosys uh, interview. If you have not yet subscribed to our channel, please do subscribe, click on subscribe and then click on bell icon so that you do not miss any kind of videos which we update. And now there are many problems, many queries for which you are putting the comments in the videos, which I am really not able to take it and we are not able to take it. So we have the telegram group. So you can put all your doubts over there and people, those who are having, you know, uh, the mails, those who are having the text, they will reply. See, RD 2020 is eligible for Infosys. Do not worry, guys, right? So there are many people who has the queries like 2020 batch is, uh, you know, eligible for Infosys or not. They will be getting the uh, interview mail or not. So all those queries is definitely going to get answered in this particular video. But Telegram group also, uh, there are people who has already joined or who has already, you know, given the interview for Infosys and they're from 2020 batch. So they have also commented down over there. So your queries will get resolved easier. Now, so friends, the question is, so sir, I am from 2020 batch. Will I be, you know, uh, so will I be able to give the interview of Infosys or not? So friends, if you're from 2020 batch and if you have already qualified for the first round, if you have already qualified for the round one of Infosys, then 100% you will be getting a chance to uh, chance for the interview round. So you do not have to worry at all, friends. Many student has these queries. So if you are from 2020 batch, you are definitely going to attend the interview of Infosys. See, this is the this is the mail. Okay, this is a screenshot of a email actually. So basically, the, stu the student is also from 2020 batch, and he has already he has already attended the interview of Infosys. So if you are from 2020 batch, you do not have to worry about that. 2019, I have not got any clarity as of now. So if I get to know anything, I will let you know, friends. I never say anything which is not confirmed. Okay. So see, uh, according to me. 2019 batch is also applicable, but still I am waiting for some confirmation and then only I'll be able to 100% confirm you. Now, see, there are a lot of queries and a lot of comments are coming down and I, I have come for that itself. So that video is for that itself. Sir, I'm from 2021 mechanical, civil, electrical batch. So mechanical, civil, electrical, IT, any, all kind of streams. I have not still got the interview mail. Sir, I'm from 2020 batch. So I have not still got the, you know, all branches like CS, IT, but still I have not got the interview mail. So friends, I wanted to tell you, please wait. Do not get panic. Prepare. You will definitely get. See, in the first video itself, I had told you, if we have got round one result, okay, if we have shortlisted in round one, then definitely the interview will happen for you, man. Do not worry. See, if we have... See, uh, many students will ping, many students will message, many students will email. See, what is this? I mean, how can we answer this? See, we know that it will happen, but when it will happen, nobody knows. See, the interview happens based on the requirement, right? So, see, first what they did, so they started with CES, IT candidates, okay? Because they were needing that. Then they will start with the non-IT. They started with 2021. Then they will start with 2020. So, they have certain kind of a strategy they follow. So friends, you have to wait. If we have cleared round one, then definitely interview also will be scheduled for you. You need to wait. There is no other option, okay? If you are getting so much panic, you can send a mail to Infosys. But if you are continuously sending the mail to Infosys, that is also not good, right? So they will also read the mail. This guy is so much, you know, overexcited. So one time you can send a mail to Infosys. But friends, trust me, you will be getting. So wait, the interview has not got over. They have some certain plans. Do not get panic. If you will behave like this, then definitely there will be something wrong will be there. Okay. See, as I said, 
so everybody will be getting 2021 2020 so if you have cleared round 1 then you are eligible for the infosys interview so please wait okay or you can send a mail to infosys no one else is going to help you because nobody is having any information why they are delaying it okay but as far as we know there is certain plans there is certain requirements based on that all hiring happens okay fine so friends uh, as i said if you join the telegram group you will come to know okay so you can see so 2020 uh, batch is eligible for infosys okay so this guy has already given the uh, interview okay now friends uh, so there are many question which was asked from computer networks and i will talk about uh, the terms in a very easy way so these are lan man wan okay and osi model is a very famous questions now from the computer network and th those who are from electrical computer backgrounds so this this people will be getting this question okay so in a very simple words we will understand so what is lan so local area network so local area network okay so this is your ethernet cable will be there right so through your ethernet cable there will be many computers will be connected okay so a group of computers will be connected through a ethernet cable so local area network is a group of computers connected with each other in a small places such as the school hospitals and apartment okay so in apartment you will see so through a ethernet cable there will be many computers will be connected in a school also we will see the same thing hospitals also we will see the same thing see a school is a private right so a school is private means what i mean to say is so it's a kind of building hospital is a kind of building apartment is a kind of building so it it is restricted to one building right it is restricted to one building and lan local area network is also called as private network okay also called as private network so lan is secure because there is no outside connection so we are doing inside a school we are doing inside a hospital we are doing inside a apartment so it is secure okay it is not over uh, i mean you cannot say it is over cities or over something right so this is secure okay lan due to their smaller size are considerably faster their speed can range anywhere from 100 to 100 mbps okay so friends the lan will be smaller in size because it is a spreaded across a apartment it is spreaded across a hospital it is spreaded across a school so it will be small in size and it will be uh, considerably faster so their speed can range anywhere between 100 to 100 mbps lans are not limited to wired connection so even you can see wifi at your home so wireless connection okay so lan uh, is not limited to wire connection there is a new evolution to the lans that allows local area network to work on a wireless connection okay so we also have the wireless connection now okay so lan in a simple words so lan will be used uh, in uh, in a limited uh, you can say limited places like school hospital apartment so there will be limited space will be there it will be also a private network lan will be secure because there is no outside connection it will be faster because uh, you know uh it is small in size and lans are not only limited to wired connection it is also wireless okay man so man is nothing but metropolitan area network okay so man networks covers large area by connection lans to a larger network of computer okay so like for small towns and small cities we will be using uh, man okay so lan is like only for one apartment okay but man is for multiple apartments in a cities okay so multiple uh, houses in a small towns okay now so friends when it covers large area then definitely the speed will reduce so you can say the speed will be less okay so here the speed will be less as compared to a speed less as compared to as compared to lan because lan is spread to a very smaller area in metropolitan area network various local area networks are connected with each other through telephone lines like uh, you can say uh, it is uh, like this figure so many lans will be connected okay so many lans will be connected in a uh, man okay like metropolitan area network the size of the metropolitan area network is larger than lans and smaller than wans wide area network a man covers the larger area of a city or town see just the basic concept you need to keep in mind that's all you'll be easily able to do it then so your man will be private as well as public network man will be private as well as public network speed will be lesser as compared to lan and then if we we'll talk about the wan so wide area network so wide area networks provides long distance transmission of the data 
the size of man is see first land will be there okay and then man will be there and then van will be there so van will be wide area network okay the size of van is larger than land and man a van can cover country continent or even a whole world so even a whole world can use a van wide area network or a country or a continent okay internet connection is an example of van so we use the internet connection right so that is example of van other example of vans are mobile broadband connections such as 3g 4g and in future uh, 5g so will be coming so this is all our example of a van so you see there is only one uh, airtel 4g right so airtel 4g and whole india is using airtel 4g right so whole india is using airtel 4g uh, whole india was using earlier 3g right and whole india will be using 5g so it is spreaded across a country which is india okay now so friends uh, osi model so this is also very very important so osi is nothing but open system interconnection okay see in generally in interview they will ask so if you will tell the seven layer names also that is um, that will be enough okay so that will be enough so if you will tell the names also that will be enough so no need to dig much into the uh, all the layers okay so this will be your uh, osi models it will have seven layers the first layer will be physical layer so this is actually uh, uh, this will be from bottom to top okay so physical layer is the first layer and then we will be having data link layer then we will be having uh, network layer transport layer session layer presentation layer and application layer application layer will be the seventh layer okay so osi model open system interconnection models a conceptual framework that describes the function of a networking or telecommunication system okay so first one will be physical layer data link layer network layer transport layer in the same order okay this is second layer this is third layer this is fourth layer this is fifth sixth seventh okay so this is how you know, this explains the function of a networking or a telecommunication system okay now how do you remember so pratik do not teach sasta presentation application okay so pratik pratik means physical p for physical okay physical layer this is the from the bottom first layer okay and then do do means uh, data link layer not not means network layer teach teach means transport layer sasta session layer presentation is already a layer application is already a layer okay so this is how you will be able to remember all the seven layers in particular order so pratik do not teach sasta presentation application okay now friends uh, i have also written in one line so uh, your physical layer so all the physical and the electrical connection uh, uh, will be there on this physical particular layer okay data link layer so data link layer will provide node to node data transfer so it will be you know put in a frame in terms of frame uh, we, uh, we will put the we will put the data and then we will be sending it network layer is a, uh, is where you will find most of the routing functionality so or your mac layer okay llc layer so all those will be defined at the network layer so i'm not going into very much deep so where you will find most of the routing functionality means it will tell how your packets will be routed okay now transport layer you will be definitely knowing tcp uh, udp right so deals with the coordination of the data transfer between end system and host so which packet uh, has to go where so you also might be knowing tcp port right udp port so uh, the uh, transport layer will be responsible for the data transfer between end system and host okay so uh, one will be connectionless and one will be uh, connection oriented uh, oriented okay so tcp will be uh, connection oriented udp will be connectionless okay then session layer so all the sessions like uh, you know when we establish a session uh, for so when we talk right so when two person talk that time a session will be established okay so when we disconnect a session will be terminated so all the sip layer session initi initiation protocol so all those things layer will be defined will be defined on session layer presentation layer so everything with respect to uh, syntax or semantic um that application accepts so that will be in presentation layer this is also called as syntax layer okay application layer so whatever you see like google chrome firefox safari telnet ftp all are uh, you know the best on the application layer okay so this is a very much basic knowledge if you have then easily you will be able to clear this uh, uh, your computer networks part okay and friends as i am mentioning again so if you are from 2020 batch 
friends do not get panic be relaxed prepare for interview you are going to get the interview call okay so they are not calling everyone together so based on the requirement they will be calling so do not worry each and every update we will be giving you if you have still not joined our telegram group please do join and subscribe to our youtube channel thank you friends